This is the third of a series of videos walking through the capabilities of the FireTech devices. In the first video, we walk through all the capabilities that come with a single FTH48FX module. In the second video, we walk through the additional capabilities that the system has when you add multiple FTH48FX modules. Both of those videos were focused on the capabilities without the FTM99 remote. In this video, we're going to walk through a number of diagrams showing the additional control that comes with the addition of the FTM99 remote to the system. The FTM99 remote can control up to 99 FireTech modules or other FTM99 remotes across the Intelligent Mesh network. The FireTech remote can replace the master module described in the flexible capabilities with multiple FTH48FX modules. Besides providing manual push-button firing across all network modules, the FireTech remote provides real-time bi-directional communication with all the modules on the Intelligent Mesh network. Critical information of each of the modules is displayed on the remote's large, easy-to-read screen. The remote provides real-time monitoring, enunciating critical warnings to the operator. Additionally, it can play and control audio and timecode. The following are a few selected configurations we're going to walk through. First, manually firing with the remote. The FireTech remote can establish an intelligent mesh network with up to 99 additional modules. Pyrotechnic cues of the FireTech modules can be manually fired from the remote across all networked modules. The remote allows you to manually fire linked modules. When in test mode, you can link the modules with IDs 1, 2, 3, and 4. This allows you to manually, simultaneously fire cues across groups of modules. You can simultaneously fire identical cues across linked groups ID 1 and 2, group ID 1, 2, and 3, and group ID 1, 2, 3, and 4. The FireTech remote with its mesh network of up to 99 additional modules can be connected to a computer via a USB cable. The script can be loaded into the remote and transmitted to all of the slave modules. The script can then be controlled via the computer with synchronized audio. Additionally, you can do a scripted pyro musical completely controlled by the remote. The pyro musical script can be loaded into the FireTech remote and transmitted to all of the slave modules across the Intelligent Mesh network. The audio file can be loaded into the remote or it can be read directly off a USB drive by the remote. The FireTech remote can directly play the audio and control the synchronized script. This is the configuration I used for my first pyro musical. With the audio file on the USB player, the audio was played by the remote and fed to my sound system. The setup worked flawlessly. Scripted pyro musicals can also be controlled with the Android FT control application and the remote. Just as we showed an Android device can be connected to a master module, the Android device can also be connected to the remote. The Pyro Musical script can be loaded into the FireTech remote and transmitted to all of the modules through the Intelligent Mesh network. The Android device can then play the audio synchronized with the script. Control is available by both the remote and the FT Control Android application. The Android application gives you additional functionality complementing the remote. Sequences or individual scripts can be preloaded into the FireTech remote and modules and can be controlled by the FireTech remote across all of the networked modules. And just as you could step fire a preloaded script directly with the module, you can use the networked FTM99 remote to step fire through a script across all of the networked modules. This script would be preloaded into the remote and transmitted to all of the modules via the Intelligent Mesh network. Just as we showed a slave module connected to an Android device could provide additional audio control to your setup, an additional FTM99 remote can be set up as an additional audio player connected to the Intelligent Mesh network. The slaved FireTech remote will directly play the audio to the synchronized script. The FireTech remote can establish an Intelligent Mesh network with up to 99 additional modules. In addition to controlling the FireTech slave modules, 
The FireTech remote has an internal timecode generator. This can be used to synchronize additional systems to the FireTech system. In this diagram here, the remote is providing a timecode signal to the external system, allowing both systems to be synchronized. The FireTech remote with the GPS option can be used to control all of the devices across the Intelligent Mesh network and synchronize them to GPS time. Additionally, a FireTech remote can be used to set the start time to individual GPS-enabled modules that have a preloaded script. As showed with the multiple module configurations, the FireTech system has a two-wire networking option. A FireTech remote can control up to 99 additional FireTech modules across a two-wire network. Manual push-button firing or a pyrotechnic script, including sequences, can be preloaded into the FireTech remote and modules and can be controlled via the FireTech remote. Audio box functions are also available via the two-wire connection. With DMX option, DMX is also available. So that was a quick run-through of just some of the diagrams highlighting the additional capabilities that come with the FireTech FTM99S remote. I hope you found that useful. Please leave comments and questions below and I will leave a link in the description where you can download this presentation. Also don't forget to check out the other videos on the Ignite channel.